Now, more than 100,000 people are expected at Blenheim Palace for Country File Live. The four-day event started yesterday. It's billed as a celebration of the British countryside. Jeremy Stern is there for us now, and you seem to be playing croquet there, Jeremy. Yeah, I'm having a go. I'm, I'm not very good, am I, John? So we, so we have it, just have a... That's it. My best yet. Thank you okay, very much. Well done. Thank Enjoy you. the day. Thank you. Thank you, John. Now, over here, we've got so much more here at Blenheim Palace. This is the village fete area. We have some Morris dancers who are starting up over there. We've got maypole dancing, all sorts going on. This is a 100-acre site. We've also had dog obediency classes. People had the chance to try different foods. I've been asking them about what brought them to Blenheim Palace today favourite bit so far, the dog show. I've been watching the dog show all day. Like. <laughs> I used to farm, so it's the agricultural part of it as well. What's your favourite bit, Harry? Combine harvest. Combine harvest is only up. It was a good excuse to come here, see Blenheim Palace and have a look around. Maybe see some presenters if we're lucky. Well, there are plenty of presenters, country file presenters here. You just have to know where to find them. I caught up with a very familiar face a little bit earlier. It's a meeting of town and country in a, in a very pleasant way. And, and that reflects our audience uh, on the TV show as well, around about 50-50. Uh, so people have a, you know, can, can interact uh, and, and have a good time at the same time. Country Fire Live is essentially about celebrating the countryside, but there have been some serious issues addressed here today, not least Brexit, how that could affect British agriculture, and how to get here. Last year, the traffic was a mess. This year seems to have been quite a lot better. But the advice to people coming tomorrow and on Sunday is get here early, and why wouldn't you? Jeremy, thank you very much. We'll leave you to play your croquet. For now, let's find out how our weather forecast...